Everyone loves watching a cute as a button flower girl make her way down the aisle during a wedding ceremony, but a lot goes into making this little one feel comfortable and included in your nuptials. Here are a few easy ways to give her an experience that she'll remember for the rest of her life. How to help your wedding's flower girl in 8 simple steps. 1. Give your flower girl time to rehearse you know what they say about practice. While the flower girl should obviously be part of the rehearsal, it's important to provide her with plenty of opportunities to practice in other ways. Make it into a game by asking her to show you her walk from time to time. This will give her plenty of opportunity to get her walk down just right and instill confidence. This step is particularly important for younger flower girls who may not be as sure-footed as an older child. 2. Spend time together with your flower girl While most little girls will be more than happy to be a flower girl, walking down the aisle in front of a crowd is bound to make anyone nervous. Set some time aside a few weeks before the wedding to spend time alone with your flower girl doing a fun activity. This will help put her at ease and show her that you can be trusted. 3. Coordinate her ensemble When thinking about what the flower girl is going to wear, consider having her outfit coordinate with you or the wedding party. If your bridesmaids are getting updos, give her one too. If you're getting your makeup done professionally, give her a few touches of glamour as well. This will help her feel like a part of the group. 4. Help her feel included Having your flower girl participate in all of the beauty rituals with you and your gal pals will help her feel included in the festivities, while also potentially calming some nerves. Just make sure that if she's getting her hair done that you select a style that's simple to create. Young children will often get bored of sitting in the stylist's chair for hours at a time. Her parents should also always be close by to step in if an emergency arises. 5. Propose, in a special way find a fun way to ask her to be your flower girl. There are numerous ideas for this on Pinterest, but some of our favorite methods include the classic ring pop proposal, providing her with a book about being a flower girl, and giving her a puzzle to assemble with the proposal written on it. 6. Find your flower girl a special helper Depending on the age and personality of your flower girl, you may find that she feels a little overwhelmed by all of the hustle and bustle on the big day. Appoint her mother or other woman that she trusts to be her helper during the wedding. This person should help her stay on track and keep her feeling safe during the day's festivities. 7. Give your flower girl a gift on the day of your wedding. Be sure to give your flower girl a small gift as a token of appreciation for her presence at your wedding. Though there are many different options out there, a sparkling necklace or a cute pair of shoes will not only bring delight, but also make her look extra cute while walking down the aisle. 8. Schedule downtime. As Martha Stewart Weddings shares, thanks to the unfamiliarity and fast pace of weddings, little kids may burn out quickly. Be sure to give them some downtime throughout the day. This is especially important if you plan to have little ones around for any pre-ceremony photos. The shorter the time required for taking pictures beforehand, the better your chances are for a compliant ring bearer or flower girl.